Hi guys, my name's Jason and welcome back to my YouTube channel, Everyday Motorbiking. Today I'm going to do a review on my 2021 DR650SE. This is my go-to dual purpose adventure bike that you'll be seeing a lot of in my future past videos and future videos on YouTube. So basically I've modded this bike out to do some fairly serious adventure biking and yeah basically travel within Australia. So uh, basically going to start with, um, I'll come to the camera, going to start with the actual uh, pannier bags which are a, a giant loop uh, pannier bag. They are yeah, really good. They've got the racks as well uh, to support the bags with the, the bar around the back. And I've got some LED uh, blinkers on the rear, uh, tail tidy. Also coming down to, I've got a, a center stand in regards to easy maintenance, uh, like for instance, changing some flat tires or uh, lubing the chain. Yeah, it just uh, makes it easier when you're out on the road. Also, I've got the, the Warp 9 large foot pegs just for, for comfort when traveling and being able to stand up a lot easier. They're, they're awesome guys, well worth it. I know they're expensive, but yeah, well worth it to be uh, comfortable out on the road. Also, I've got the Warp 9, um, Warp 9 case protectors. Uh, I've got the Safari fuel tank, 30 litre. Also, coming around to the front of the bike, I've got the Bark Busters and the, the guards, which have the, the blinkers incorporated into them, which I just think it looks a, a bit, bit more tidier and it adds some character and look to the bike. Basically, I've changed out the, the bars as well and uh, put some new grips on. Also, I've got a quad lock for my phone and Basically, I run the Zoomy, Garmin Zoomy GPS, where I do a lot of my um, mapping and routing in regards to my travels. And yeah, basically also in regards to that, I've uh, downloaded some GPX files or uh, that were online to map out my, my tracks and, and where I'm going and yeah, being able to see some really beautiful country. Uh, so yeah, that basically covers the bike. I haven't done any um, engine mods like um, to the carby or anything like that. And yeah, put any uh, muffler or an exhaust system or anything on the bike. I'm quite happy with the, the power that the bike produces and it serves m my needs. Um, and yeah, basically the other thing that I've done to the bike is the suspension upgrade both um, forks and, and rear spring, which makes a massive difference on the DR650. They are known to have pretty pretty poor poor suspension. Okay, guys, that uh, basically uh, covers covers my review of my DR650. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you've got any questions, just uh, let us know. Cheers. Till next time. Bye.